we joke about um, you can't recruit for masonry. You're not allowed to recruit for masonry. You told me that again. You can't make me join the masons. You said so. I said you're right. I can't make you join the masons, but I can make you join DMLA because we recruit for that all day long. So and once he got in, he loves it and he's enjoying the heck out of it. And I'm an advisor with them. So the chapter we're involved with um, is doing really great things. Uh, they won all kinds of competitions and stuff. And um, he's really active in that. This virus has kind of made, got to put a damper on things, but they still, they try and meet regularly. But I think the youth in Virginia, at least, has really come back. Because when I was first, when I first joined, there was probably 25 chapters in the state. And we've lost them year by year. We've gone down. I think we're down to about 13 or 15. They've actually started opening new chapters up. And we've had chapters that weren't doing well that are coming back. Uh, Kempsville chapter that we're involved in is actually doing, they've always managed to do well. They, they, they survived and other chapters in the cities nearby have closed. So Kempsville's managed to maintain. But um, I think the youth are really, they're energized. There's younger advisors who've gotten involved in the, the Job Daughters and the Rainbow and the DMLA that are really making an effort to hit up the Masonic Lodges to volunteer to come out and serve dinner and uh, do whatever they can to get themselves in front of the Masonic groups to do service projects, to help clean the lodge and reminding the Masons of the youth groups are here. So I think the, uh, the, uh, the lodges tend to forget about the youth groups if they don't see them. If you're not actively sponsoring one, you kind of forget they're there. So they, the, the leaders here have made an effort to get the youth back in front of the Masons. Like when the Grand Commander did his official visits last year for the commandery, every official visit, the youth were there serving in his dinners. And that's like the first time that's happened. It's usually the lodge of the Grand Master's visit. You will always have the Demolay and the Joby serve and all, but not so much the other groups. So people are really making an effort to to promote the youth and getting them in front of the adults. And then the adults remember, oh yeah, we have youth. So it's helped, it's helped grow them. But I really feel like there's more of a, a positive energy that I haven't seen in recent years. So I really feel like we're, I'm getting back involved at a good time because there's more and more going on and the boys are enthusiastic and they want to do more. And I think it's going to actually grow again, which, which is encouraging because from the time I joined, it's come down a lot. It dropped.